colaborar un poquito. Sí, claro. sí, sí. Muchas gracias. Y ahora voy a pagar. Sí, ese es yo. Muchas gracias, señor. Disfruta su Bitcoin. I just paid for this Sigma stash with Bitcoin. More than a thousand people marched in El Salvador's capital on Tuesday to protest the government's adoption of Bitcoin as a... In June 2021, the Central American country of El Salvador adopted Bitcoin as legal tender. This step, approved by the Salvadorian president and a Bitcoin enthusiast Naib Bukele, took the world by surprise as El Salvador became the first nation in the world to do so. Being a developing country, it found many of its citizens unprepared and reluctant to accept this volatile cryptocurrency as a new method of payment. Fascinated by what may be a huge milestone in the world's history, I simply had to see what the hell was going on in El Salvador. Welcome to El Salvador. We just crossed the border from Guatemala and... Is that Michael snoring? Yeah, he's the worst. It's unbelievable. El Salvador is a country with a lot of world records. It has the highest homicide rate in the world. Ludo, you have to be respectful towards the locals. Yeah, of course, I'm always. And besides that, it's the first country in the world that adopted Bitcoin as their official currency. You keep this information in mind because we're about to explore an incredibly special place that cannot be found anywhere else in the world. El Salvador. Michael, did you sleep well? Yeah. Yeah, everyone heard that. El Salvador with the capital San Salvador. I always mistake them. El Salvador the country, San Salvador the capital. Right, now we need to find Jorge and his girlfriend that are gonna drive us to this special place. Jorge is a friend of a friend of a friend of a friend of an enemy. In every place, maybe you can pay with Bitcoin. Oh, every single place? Yeah. Really, here in the capital? For the Chivo wallet. Oh yeah, but we need so to download the Chivo wallet, wallet right? Yeah. At the center of El Salvador's shift to Bitcoin is Chivo, a government-controlled cryptocurrency wallet that you can download as an app on your phone. It lets you send and receive cryptocurrency and each Salvadoran gets a free $30 in Bitcoin as an incentive for downloading it. However, not everyone uses it or likes it. We slammed some welcome beers and decided to find where the reality lied by trying to pay for goods with Bitcoin for the first time in our lives. This country is Americanized. You have Walmart here and we're gonna buy a SIM card, uh, hopefully with Bitcoin. Only two options here, either Bitcoin or American And dollars. third option, the Slovak option, is to steal. <laughs> <laughs> Very tipsy atmosphere on this vlog. Can I leave it here? Thank you. Another half drunk vlog. The Salvadoran Walmart with Bitcoin size above the cash registers made us jump for joy as we were expecting a historical moment of purchasing something real with cryptocurrency. But as luck would have it, the Bitcoin gods were against us. Using cash. Oh, okay, only in okay. cash. <laughs> so we were not able to pay with Bitcoin, not even a card. So we had to pay by cash. That's why we have to go. Thank you very much. That's why we have to go to the special place that I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Let's go. Welcome to the Bitcoin beach. Look, one free beer with food purchase. An hour's drive from the capital lies a small coastal village, El Zonte. 
At first glance, it looks quite ordinary and nothing suggests that it is somehow special. However, El Zonte is the only place in the world where Bitcoin buys you literally anything. Often referred to as the Bitcoin Beach, El Zonte's shift to Bitcoin economy is one hell of a story. In 2019, an anonymous guy with a fondness for El Zonte discovered a forgotten USB drive loaded with Bitcoin, which made him an instant billionaire. He decided to donate a six-figure amount to El Zonte each year and create a Bitcoin economy among its 3,000 residents. The village was nicknamed Bitcoin Beach and started to use their own wallet app named Bitcoin Beach Wallet. After our initial setback in the capital's Walmart, we arrived to El Zonte to discover if this rural village is really making history. Alright, so Michael is going to try to buy some beers with Bitcoin. Can we pay with Bitcoin? Daddy is paying. The girl. Are you opening the app called Chivo now? No. And you are opening what application? Bitcoin. Bitcoin. Mm -hmm. Se llama solo Bitcoin. Con so. Beach. Bitcoin con Beach? Mm -hmm. so, Bitcoin Beach. Ah, okay. Okay, the QR code. You just scanned it. Um, it's not in uh, Bitcoin, it's in dollars again. No? Eso es en Bitcoin? Eso es en dollar, no? Uh, it's the, the mismo. Uh, it's in dollars, no? Ah, oh, ahora es en Bitcoin. Ah, okay. Sí, sí, sí. Okay, so scan the QR code, Michael. Now you just need to press send. And now just confirm. Yes. Password. Password. So your password is one, two, three. Everyone knows that. Okay. It's pagado. paid, right? Es pagado? Vamos a chequear si es pagado. Pagado. Perfecto. <laughs> he bought beers from Thank a small shop with Bitcoin. Probably the future, yeah. Probably the future. Starting here in El Salvador. This is El Sante, and guess what it is? El Salvador, La Libertad. El Sonte. El Sonte. It's actually a surf town where you can actually have fun, enjoy, go to the beach. Pay with Bitcoin. Time. And guess what? Pay with Bitcoin. Look at the that. The B word. So please. El Sonte, the famous Bitcoin beach, the only place in the world where I think every business accepts Bitcoin here. Basically That's, every business. It is what it is. Yes, it is. Hey, so it is. Come here. Let's go. It is about welcoming the right people. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at this. This guy, guy is a Bitcoin guy too. Jorik is from France. France. Bitcoin. Oh, je suis Pierre. Yeah. Enchanté. I'm Peter. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Bitcoin balling, gonna chat calling. What you need, baby, I got you. Bitcoin guy. Such a familiar face. I think I've seen this guy somewhere. Oh, we're balling, we're balling. Here it is. <laughs> Bitcoin balling. You're sleeping, you're sleeping. Bitcoin balling. It seems like the Bitcoin community is really fun. <laughs> really, really, really fun. The real, real meaning in life is this. Stay humble because that's what life is all about. From the bottom of my heart, nothing else. The bottom of my heart. Thank you. Guys, you've heard it. Guys, you've heard it. Even if you have 10 Bitcoins, stay humble. Let's buy some coconuts. With these cool caps. Bitcoin balling, gonna chat calling what you Already need. tipsy, we decided that instead of a coconut, we should buy Coke, Coca-Cola. <clears throat> and after the caffeine boost, the day took an unexpected turn, which meant filming had to be postponed until the next day. All right, um, let's not talk about yesterday and focus on Bitcoin. This is a Bitcoin ATM. I'm gonna show you the whole process of putting Bitcoin into your wallet and paying for basically everything. We're not in El Sonte, mm. we're in El Tunco, which is basically the same place with businesses that accept Bitcoin, with salesmen, with, with street sellers that accept Bitcoin. Let's go! 
is a village right next to El Zonte. Everything suggested that we could continue with our Bitcoin shopping spree, but El Tunco revealed that there were still issues associated with this cryptocurrency and Bitcoin is still far from fully adopted in El Salvador. So this is the Bitcoin ATM. Ludo forced me to download a Bitcoin wallet called Coin Coinomi. Alright, I have zero euros there. So you click here, to receive, that's your address right here. Let's uh, choose that you want Bitcoin, not yes. Litecoin. Yeah, I want Bitcoin. So let's press here. There's Czech language here. I think... There's Czech language. No, it doesn't work. <laughs> Czech language. Bye. Yeah, Bye. First. Right here. Hold on. Oh, nice. Oh, additional fee. Four USD. That's well, a lot. It's a lot, yeah. Now I'm gonna insert, I don't know, thirty dollars. Depends what you wanna buy. Well, we're gonna. Or you can just hold it and it will turn into millions. <laughs> <laughs> I'm inserting ten dollars here. It doesn't accept tens. Twenty dollar banknote. Doesn't want money. This is definitely not a female. All right, plenty more. So now you just need to buy Bitcoin. Buy, buy Bitcoin. <sighs> Failed? What the? F Write down the transaction ID and contact customer support. There goes your forty dollars. I'm gonna write them on WhatsApp. How do you say I put? He puesto 40 dollars in el cajero, se, se rompió. You're the guy we need. Can you tell them, like, fuck you guys? 24 horas y regresan el dinero. Okay, está bien, gracias. 24 hours for uh, return the, the money. It can take up to 24 hours. Yeah. We're gonna use uh, Michael's wallet then. We're still gonna show it to the world how it works. But not with my money, with Michael's money. What is the price? It's pricey off. Ocho, no? Ocho se puede. Puedo pagar en Bitcoin y uh, podemos hacer un video. Sí, pero yo tengo la la aplicación Chivo. Chivo, sí, es bien. Está bien. Okay. This is the QR code of the of the salesman. You're gonna scan it right now on your phone. Send. Confirm. Confirm. I need to just put up my password. Okay. One, two, three. Sent. It's sent. Check if you have it. Recibiste su dinero? Si. Perfecto. So we just bought a necklace for Bitcoin. Okay, gracias. Yeah. Ciao, ciao. It seemed we found another Bitcoin beach, but we were so, so wrong. Ice cold coconuts. Hola. Hola. Por favor, podemos. Podemos pagar con Bitcoin. Ah no. Ah, no se puede. Hay algún otro lugar donde podemos comprar coco con Bitcoin acá? No. Disculpa, señora. Se puede pagar con Bitcoin acá? No se puede. Disculpa. Aceptan Bitcoin acá? No. No aceptan Bitcoin. ¿Por qué no tienen chivo? Tal vez personal, pero el negocio aún no. Hola. Aceptan Bitcoin acá? No, no aceptan Bitcoin. Ok, gracias. ¿Se puede pagar con Bitcoin? ¿Acá? Sí, con Bitcoin. No se puede. ¿No tienes chivo? Tengo chivo, pero ¿Sí? se me cerró la cuenta. No sé cómo abrirla. El Tunco, just like the rest of El Salvador, had some problems with Bitcoin payments. Some people preferred cash, some didn't have the Chivo wallet or didn't know how to use it properly. It really seemed that the only place in the world where Bitcoin was accepted everywhere with no issues was El Zonte, the Bitcoin beach. In order to find and film an authentic street buying experience, we headed back there, only to find out that the customer support for the broken ATM solved my problem. They sent me the, the Bitcoin. I got it. 29 euros. So how does it feel? Have I have Bitcoin. Bitcoin. I have Bitcoin. How does it feel? It to feels great. Podemos pagar con Bitcoin? Espérame, pero con otro, con otro amigo. Pues cómo lo hacemos? Bitcoin Beach, la aplicación. Yeah. Sí. Todo el mundo lo usa acá. Bitcoin Beach. Sí, la mayoría. Ah, bien. Mm, sí. QR code. Send. 
confirm password. Okay. One, two, three. I think it's sent. Recibiste el dinero? Pendiente. Pendiente. Entonces tenemos sí. que esperar un poquito. No, no hay problema, ahí va a llegar. Siempre ah, llega. Ah, va a llegar. Sí. Perfecto. <laughs> We just bought oysters for Bitcoin from these ah, ah. great salesmen. This is how business is done in the 21st century. That's really good. It tastes even better after paying for it in Bitcoin. <laughs> That's really good. Does it remind you of something? Hola. Se puede pagar con Bitcoin acá? Okay, so we're just gonna buy uh, pasteles from this uh, from this lady. She accepts Bitcoin as everyone here in El Zonte Beach. We're gonna have six pasteles, which is a typical Salvadorian food for one dollar or 0 0.000001 Bitcoin. So I'm opening my wallet. Vamos a pagar dos con una propina. Pues podemos pagar, pero necesitamos tu celular. So I'm gonna scan it right now. Okay. Send. Password 1234. Verifying password, broadcasting. Uh, I think it's paid. No, ha caído. Es un momento. ¿Qué pasó? Apparently we're having some troubles here. We're still waiting for transaction confirmation. It's not as smooth as I would expect. It's still. I haven't gone through. It's gonna be pending, but he will see pending in his application as well, so maybe we can double check on him. Es pagado? Sí. Es pagado. Sí. Perfecto. So we paid for the... Pasteles. Pasteles, okay. Let's enjoy them and uh, maybe do one last purchase. So now we're gonna try to buy gas for Bitcoin. Pay here with your Bitcoins. We will. Wait, oh, uh, ahora? Yeah, no. Alright. Confirm. Password 1234. I think it went through. Okay. Puedes checar si, si recibiste el dinero? Si, sí, está bien. Está bien. Mucho gusto, Rodrigo. Let's go to the capital and have some final thoughts about this. We are back in the capital of the first country in the world that adopted Bitcoin as their official currency. I'm not going to predict if other countries will follow suit or if this is the future, but it was very interesting to be part of this incredible unique face of El Salvador's and who knows, maybe even the world's history. I feel it's still kind of complicated for most of the people here. Not all the businesses accept Bitcoin yet and most people still prefer to use dollars, the other official currency. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. It's actually a part of a big travel project that I'll hopefully release at the end of 2022. But I felt that this video had to be released now when Bitcoin Beach is still the only place in the world where most of the businesses and even street sellers accept Bitcoin. Hit the like button if you liked it and see you next time. We're gonna have lunch now for dollars. Bitcoin ballin', gonna chat callin', what you need, baby, I got you. Bitcoin ballin', act where we all in, it's our time, no more sleeping. uh, we ballin', we ballin', Bitcoin ballin', we ballin' and ballin', Bitcoin ballin'.